Hey boys and girls, Mr. Beard here with your class recap for Monday, November 28th. We started today with SSR and individual student meetings. So we've only got three weeks left, believe it or not, in the semester. So it's very important that we finish strong and get in any missing work now before it gets too late. So we had SSR and I uh, called over students who were missing work or who um, needed some areas of improvement um, and, and some plan of action to get that work in and uh, to have some success in the class. After that, we looked at some important papers that we're going to need for this week. First on that list is just our weekly syllabus to give you an idea of what we're going to be tackling this week. Um, today's vocab, which we'll talk about here in a second. Tomorrow, we'll be reading Where Are You Going? Where Have You Been? with some discussion questions. Wednesday, Lit Circle Day. And Thursday, Devil and Tom Walker, and then compare to that to where are you going, where have you been. It's important to remember, and you want to write this down, Thursday, the next page of your lit packet will be due. That's on our assignment calendar, so make sure you get that in. And then Friday, we'll of course have our Unit 13 vocabulary quiz, along with some more work on our literature circles. The next important paper is our Unit 13 vocab list. As you can see here, first word, accrue, to grow or accumulate over time. Two, annotation, a critical or explanatory note or comment. Go ahead and look at this word here, or these letters here, N-O-T. An annotation is just a note. So notice, note here, annotation, note. Bedlam, a state or scene of uproar and confusion. For whatever reason, I find it helpful to remember Saddam. Saddam ran Iraq. And at the end of his reign, there was a state of uproar and confusion. So Saddam, Bedlam. Four, covert, hidden, disguised, or a hiding place. Don't really think of covert as a hiding place, but that is a, uh, it's a noun form. Debonair, pleasant, courteous, lighthearted, smooth, and polished in manner and appearance. Debonair. Four, done, to demand insistently. The verb form, noun, is a creditor, and the adjective, dark, dull, dingy. With the adjective, focus on these words here, dark and dull. You may notice that from the word dungeon, because dungeon is dark and dull. Next word, aphacious is effective, producing results. Notice the first three letters here, E, F, F. They share both here. Next word, equanimity, calmness, composure, refusal to panic. We look at the first four letters here, the equa, root word in equal, which means balanced. If you are balanced, you are calm and composed. Fortuitous, accidental, occurring by a happy chance. You may look, notice that from the word fortune. Okay, it's accidental, but it is a happy accident. It is a happy accident. Something like finding a $20 bill in a pair of jeans that you totally forgot about. Last word, just the essential part, or just the main points. Just, just, share that word in common, or that sound in common. And that covers our vocab. Remember, if you were absent, you can get those from our class website, or, of course, from the makeup bin area of the classroom. So you'll need to go to the makeup bin and pick those up. So that covers what we did today in class on Monday, November 28th. Thank you for listening.